Hey, what's going on guys? Um, welcome to Draw for Fun. Today I'm going to be showing you how to draw Rick and Morty. So grab a Sharpie and let's do drawing. So first we're going to start with the guy on the right. So we have a line going up, around, and over. And we have a C shape for the ear, going around. And then for the hair we have a line that goes up, around, down, and over to about there. And then down here we're going to start on the jaw, so we have a line going out, another line going back in, giving you the square look. And then we have this circle going all the way up and around. Okay, and now for the eyes, we have a circle down here, so around, right inside that, drop for the eye. Above the eye is an eyebrow, so just a line. And then over here, for the eye, just a round circle, a dot, and then over here is an eyebrow. So right down here for the nose, we have a line just going straight over across, and then right down here is his frowny face. So we can face there. And now we're going to start on the shoulder. So we're going to bring a line up down to about there. All right. And then here on the other side, we have another line that goes up and down. And then right down here, we have a line that goes down. These two points meet together. The line going straight across. Okay. And then down here, we have a line that goes down. All the way down to there. And then for the finger, we make a thumb. And we have three fingers. So one. Two, three, or four, four fingers. And then this line goes straight up like that. And then we start here with another line to meet this one. So then this drags all the way down to about there. And then the line going straight across from the waist. So like that. We have another line going across. And now for the paint legs. So we're gonna put a line right about here. Put across. So and then we have a line that goes down all the way to about there. And then we have this square off, and then this is gonna, these two points meet together. So, line going up and around, okay? And then we have, we're gonna take, take this point all the way down to there, okay? And then this goes across, and then we take this point up here. So, straight up there, and then we're gonna bring this arm down. So there's a line that goes down to there, out, and then we have sort of like the finger hides behind the body. So now we have another line, a line, this is for the uh, ankle, so another line here, another line there, connect, and then we have a half circle. So we're going straight around, and then a line across, and then these two points connect. So like that, and then the other foot's going out the opposite way. So there's a line that goes down, another line that goes all the way over here. Then we have a line that goes to there, and then this goes and points up and around. Okay, now for the other side for uh, Morty, he's got like a octagon head. So we have a dot, we're going to start a dot there, making a half circle out wide, another half circle out wide like that, and bringing that around. Alright, and then he's got an eyebrow going straight across, so line, and it's like a tube together. Alright, and then right below that, just an eye, going around in a circle, a dot in there, another circle here, another dot there, okay, and then just below it, um, there's a wag under his eye, and then right here we have a nose, it hooks up, and another line going across, another line going there, this goes across for the mouth, and then there. Okay, so now for the hair, we're going to create a dot here, have a line going down, another line going back over, another line going up, down, and then you just bring these spikes all the way around the head like this. Okay, and then right here, a backward C for the ear, so there's a C, and then we're going to connect these points. So we're going to do these little jagged marks for the hair, bring it all the way up so we connect to that point. Okay, and then on the opposite side, again, more hair. So a line, another line going up, down, up, down, and then we're going to create more little jagged lines. So we have a line going down, up, down, up, down, up, and then there's his head. And we're going to round this off just a little bit. 
to make it rounder. So then for the neck, we have a line that goes down, a line that goes down, and then for the neck line, we have a line that goes down and over. And just gonna hurry a little bit for the um, video, guys. So then there's another line that goes up and across, another line that goes over and across, and then we have the arm that goes all the way down to about here. So it stops. Okay, and then for the body, we have a line that curves out and stops about there. Same thing on the other side, another line that curves out, stops there. And we're going to take this line all the way down to about here. And then we're going to go ahead and start here and give it a line for the waist. So we have a mark going there. And we're going to bring this all the way down for the foot, or the leg, sorry. And this goes down, this goes up, and then you're going to give him like a little bit of a cross line right there. So then this goes all the way up like that, around. And then we're going to bring this all the way down to here for the other line. So there it goes, down. This goes all the way up to about there and we're going to leave that there for now and then we're going to work on the shoes down here so uh, we have a line that goes over here um, I want to skip so I can show you guys the uh, the rest of this the bottom so we have another two lines connecting um, another line going straight out another line going back in like this and then we have a line going across a line going back in over this point connects to there, this point connects to there, and those are our shoes, okay? So now right here, this line continues to extend down. We're going to start at the top, and then this line goes all the way down to here, and we just square this point off like that. So now what we do, we have another line that goes across, and then we're going to do the hand. So the hand is like a Dracula hand, I swear. And his bone goes out like that. I guess that's what happens when he gets old. Your hands just get like really weird looking. Um, so now what it's going to do, we're going to curve uh, this waistline here. So we're going to make a belt. So we have a line that goes over, over, connect. And then we connect this part to that part. And this is just like a little square. And then this belt runs all the way across like so. And then we take this end up to there, and then go ahead and we're going to give him a little cape thing here. So we're going to bring a line down to about this point, another line going back over. This line goes straight across, another line going down, another line going over, and then that's the cape. So now he's got these little um, designs on the shirt, so there's a little, just a little triangle, so the line going out. Another line going back in, another line going out, another line going back in, and we're going to give him one more. Another line going out, another line going back in. Same thing on the other side. The line going out, and the end of the line going down. Then we create another line going down, another line going over, down, over. Okay, and then we do, we take this all the way down to about there, and same thing over here. Actually, we did it on this side, we did it on that side. Um, his arm like hides behind here. So you won't be able to see in the picture. So, All right, there you guys have it. That is Rick and Morty from um, that show. Hey, don't forget to subscribe um, to the channel and make sure you click the bell as well. And again, thanks for watching, guys. Let me know if you have any drawing requests. And okay.